Restaurants and shops are pinning their hopes on the Calgary Stampede over the next week. The annual event got underway yesterday, and business owners are hoping for a much-needed boost amid a big downturn in the local economy. The CBC's Kata Dak reports. Stephen Avenue appears to be bustling, but that's deceiving, say shop owners. You can still see a lot of people, but in terms of like people spending, it has tremend tremendously decreased. Jeweler Ann Bacalso says her sales have dropped nearly 30% over last year. It's bad for the business. Most restaurants and shops report 15 to even 40% losses. Others don't want to say in real numbers. We're down. We're down from last year and the year before. So, yeah. The Downtown Calgary Association's appealing to people to get out and spend. The fact that the businesses are down in revenues just says, please support them. And we went through this with the flood and people came out in droves and really, really helped because they, they realized these businesses could disappear. How much Stampeders could spend this year may be different. We know during the flood, more people had jobs, wages and spending power. Now, according to Calgary's Chamber of Commerce, we're at almost 6% unemployment. I really do encourage people to just exercise caution. Enjoy Stampede, says the Chamber of Commerce, but don't bust the bank to do it. No doubt people will party. Just how much remains to be seen. We'll see how Stampede goes. <laughs> We've lots of reservations, but I'm sure people will definitely be um, not as excessive this year, I feel. Fortunately, Americans get a 20% gain on their dollar. It might be tourism that helps out if locals can't. Kata Dak, CBC News, Calgary.